Well, that noise and that sound means it's time to talk about the weather. Uh, Steve Sosna here with us. Uh, sir, it's a beautiful day today. Have to say, we've been going through a bit of a roller coaster, as, as I mentioned. But as you also said, March is a bag of tricks. It's like I love March, but you yeah. never know what you're going to get, especially in this region. Uh, so it should be good tonight. People are heading out. What can they expect as we go into the overnight? Even tonight's a trick, Stefan. <laughs> we're, we're, we're talking about you know early evening yeah. being good, then late evening, all of a sudden you get that change. It's just that time of the year. But you know we're headed in the right direction. Spring officially begins on Monday, so we're going to have some bumps here along the way. One of those bumps coming here tonight. You can see that on the radar picture behind me. Those are blue colors. That means snow showers. We're not going to see any of those in the Baltimore area. Western Maryland will, but the cold weather we will see. So let's take a look at that. As you can see, that cold air pouring in here. The good news is it's in and out of here pretty quickly. So we will get a warm up, but for the next, uh, let's say, 24 hours or so, we are certainly cold. Already cooling off. 28 degrees in Oakland right now. We're looking at 47 Hagerstown. Baltimore, we're still holding on to 51 degrees. So all is good right now at the moment. This is what you're going to feel, though. It's all about the wind here this evening, tonight, through the entire day tomorrow. We're looking at wind sustained in Baltimore, 22 miles per hour. Hagerstown, 24 miles per hour at the moment. So follow the hour by hour forecast, of course, because that is changing each and every hour. You don't always see that near 40 at midnight. And as you can see, by two in the morning, 38 degrees in town with the wind, it's going to feel even colder. Out in Western Maryland tonight, upper teens, low 20s. Meanwhile, here in the city, 28 degrees, 25 in Frederick. But add in the wind, tomorrow morning you're waking up to wind chills, feeling like the teens for a couple of hours. The sun will be out there, and so will the gusty wind. So we have a powerful cold front moving on through. There's those cold snow showers moving on through upstate Pennsylvania, not for us. We're going to get a brilliant blue sky tomorrow. It's kind of deceptive sunshine. You look out the window, looks like a gorgeous day, but the feel tomorrow is not all that great. As you can see, some fair weather clouds off to the north, and then high pressure starts to build in here. And this is going to be at the steering wheel this week. That means some milder weather, some nice weather to start off the week. By the end of the week, high pressure slides to the east, and we could be looking at some clouds and some showers, which is typical for early spring. We're looking at temperatures during the day tomorrow. Yeah, they're in the struggle category. Low 40s, we should be in the mid to upper 50s. And your exclusive seven day forecast looks really good here. 44 degrees for your Sunday. So that's the chilly day, but by Monday, 54 degrees. So we gain 10, a little less wind too. Tuesday, 62 degrees sunshine. Get out of the way for Wednesday because that's when the warm up begins. 64 degrees, 70 degrees on Thursday. And then as we go into Thursday night, Friday, and into Saturday, a couple showers, not a big washout, but it'll help flush some of that pollen out of the air. And Stefan, I know you and I will be really happy about that with many other people.